existing. Rena, on the other hand, was thought to be the domain of the gods, a paradise where the souls of the departed could rest forevermore. Oh, how wrong we were. In the face of Rena's unimaginable technology, its soldiers clad in huge, shining armor, and its fearsome beasts known as Zoogles, the prosperity and bounty of Dana all but disappeared overnight. That was 300 years ago. The world of Dana fell under Renin rule, and its new masters split the land into five distinct realms. And now today, Orbis Calaglia, one of the Renin's five realms. It is ruled over by the tyrant Balsef, Lord of the Firemaster Corps. Unrelenting fire scorches this barren wasteland. Dust storms course over the rocks and crags, and no relief is to be found from the oppressive heat. The Danon people toil as slaves. Day after day they suffer, under the ruthless oppression of the Renin soldiers, with only one hope of escape. Death. Only in death is their agony finally brought to an end. They have forgotten what it means to be free. So complete is the Renin's domination. kind of slave support group? Mind your own business, you work All right, with. third squad! Time to regroup! <laughs> Go on, get moving! Hey, wait for me! Thank you, Iron Mask. It's okay, Cole. Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Iron Mask, you... you're bleeding. Hm? We need to get you looked at by Doc. That bad, huh? Better safe than sorry, I suppose. 